Hello, thank you for joining us with Sweet D's Creations Try Something New Sundays. I'm here with Lisa Garcia from LuLaRoe and she's going to be giving us some tips on styling for this Sunday. So I'll hand it over to Lisa. Why don't you just tell us a little bit about yourself and Sounds how you got into good. styling and fashion. Hi guys, I am Lisa Garcia and I am a mother of two uh, and I got into fashion and LuLaRoe. Um, Growing up, I always loved playing so I'm excited today to um, share some styling tips with you. And we're very excited to have you. And she's going to be styling me. I'm very fashionably challenged, so I'm excited to see what she comes up with for me. Let's do it. Hello, so I'm here in a Luro Carly dress, and Lisa's going to show me the different ways to style the dress. All right, so first up, we have the mint blue Carly dress. And the Carly dress for Lularo, it's like a swing dress. So what you'll see is um, it's tighter in the sleeves. It's a short sleeve dress and it's tighter in the bust area and then a looser fit um, all around. So it's a really kind of fun little dress. And then on the bottom, um, and the bottom front, it's kind of higher. And if Dorothy turn to the side, it goes longer in the back. So it's a high, uh, low hemline. All right. So first styling tip number one, we are just going to grab a belt, any belt that matches. You can use a, a thick belt or a thin belt. I chose a thin belt. Um, Dorothy has, I don't know if you can see, but she has black flats on. Uh, so we're going to kind of match that with the black belt uh, that also has a little bit of a gold um, uh, inside of it too. So, so what we're going to do is go right underneath her her bust because we want to accentuate um, that her that area here okay right here and we'll tie it and there's styling okay. tip number one super cute right very and nice it matches yeah it her, matches the shoes her shoot number two with the belt so just put the belt on uh, right below your bust and then if you don't want the belt to um, show you would just kind of pull it out all around so pull it out pull it out pull it out all the way around <laughs> all right and this this dress is long enough where um, you can pull it out like that um, and it's not short it's not gonna be too short so I just hid the belt and still you have the same simple Carly dress um, but a different look so go ahead Dorothy turn around show them how that looks yeah, it gives it a whole new look. You can't even see the belt. It looks like a different dress. Yeah. And what do you think? Was that really easy? Yeah, that was really, really easy. Really easy. Just um, belt and tuck. Or of these at home. So you just need one. Um, and what you'll do is uh, you'll go right underneath the bus, pull some fabric, and then tie it with a hair tie. And then you're going to kind of fluff this. Kind of fluff it so it kind of looks like a little flower and when you're fluffing that just means you're kind of pulling should we turn to the side so they can see perfect right. so just um, pull the fabric tie the uh, hair tie and then fluff it pull it so it looks like a cute little flower and then you have a cute little hemline here and it and the Carly dress is great for um, uh, the draping look and so that's what you see there you can show them from the front and then do the little turn Perfect, and it was super simple um, and very easy, very quick. All right, so that's this trick from the inside. So, just pulling up from pulling the fabric in the middle, and Dorothy has some shorts underneath. Just in case. <laughs> she rated. And then we're gonna tie. Do the same thing that I showed you. Okay. Ah. So it's it's kind of hidden. If you don't like that little fluff there from the first round, um, then you, you would do the same thing, but pull it in from the inside and then tie uh, the hair tie in that way. And it gives it a kind of like a little cinched look. You can also do this same um, kind of trick in the back. So you'll have like a cinched back. You can also do the same um, thing right um, right by, by the okay. chest, chest too. Oh. So uh, grab wherever you kind of, uh, what, what, um, uh, Put it wherever you would like to accentuate. If you kind of want to go with the hips, put it right here. Um, if you uh, want to do it more towards the back, there you go too. It gives you kind of more of that cinched look. Oh, All right. That's a really cool trick. All right. All right. Styling tip number four: you just need 
your hands. And everybody okay. knows how to do a simple um, loop knot. Uh, so what you would do is grab some fabric, okay, loop it around your hand and pull it through. Okay, and there you go. It gives you a little bit more um, dimension in, in your, your Carly dress, okay? You can put it to the side. Uh, some people don't like that it sticks out. If that's you, simple fix is you just push it back in. You can just tuck it back in. And it's gone, okay? Uh, so you can use, uh, you can do one on the side. That's my favorite look. Uh, but you can also do the same thing on the other side too. And again, tuck it back in if you don't like that. Um, out. And you got two knot ties on each side. Okay. And, okay, style tip number five, you would need a layering top. So we chose this one. Uh, when you're thinking about layering with a top, um, having a solid base is great. Uh, but if you want to add a little bit more spunk to it, then you would just grab a, a pattern top. So we chose this one because it has the same kind of colors with it too. So you see the mint blue here and you see a lot of um, some mint blue uh, on the shirt too to kind of accentuate that, okay? So I'll have her throw that on over the top and the layering, um, layering with LuLaRoe is great because uh, you can layer up for uh, the evening or in the fall when it gets a little bit cooler. Um, so you just throw it on top, all right? And so it looks cute like this. Okay, so just pull, loop, and then push it through. And then you have a cute little knot there too. All right, so you could do the hair tie, um, hair tie or the knot trick that and it looks super cute so those are so many different ways that you can wear just a simple LuLaRoe Carly dress yeah that's perfect because for myself being a mom on the go like I don't have time to really think about my clothes to so just be able to throw on a Carly dress and then style it different ways easily definitely, definitely. very helpful okay. all right thank you Lisa any last words for us all right, um, so some of the tips that I showed you, it doesn't have to be for the LuLaRoe Carly dress. Yes, it looks super cute, um, but if you have a similar dress at home, you can definitely use the same uh, tips with the belt or the hair tie or the knot tricks. All right, thank you. So there you have it for our Try Something New Sunday, ways to style yourself. Thank you, bye guys.